Being left by drunk and loaded on drugs. done filming Jackass number two and before it came out was when the nitrous started coming to my house in cases of 600 of these whippets. I remember walking in his house and it looked like thousands to me. I mean, he would sit there and he would do whippets back to back to back to back to back to back. Like I got so fast at putting these cartridges into that container like faster than I breathe. Like I, I wasn't even breathing air. And I remember thinking like, man, this can't be good for me. Like, like I got, I'm killing myself with this stuff. I've seen a number of uh, cases of nitrous addiction. It causes a, a, a mania. I've seen manic psychoses. People get very, very dis disorganized and crazy on it. It can cause a what's called an ascending polyneuropathy where you lose feeling and motor function in your legs and on fall up to your neck and you end up on a breathing machine. You can also have cardiac arrhythmias and die suddenly. I felt like going to the Jackass number two premiere like I was showing up at my own funeral. You know, I just thought nothing's going to be this big anymore. No matter which way you slice it, everything's going to be downhill from this point. I was so afraid of the spotlight going away that I was like, ah, oh, you know, let me outdo myself for the paparazzi all the time. 